Hey, your traffic situation is a little bit more serious this morning. We've been watching a big accident up in North Austin. This is a quick area wide view of your maps before we zoom into that spot up north. Now, this is the place that may be causing you trouble. There was a fatal crash early this morning up here on uh, near 180 near I-35 and Runberg rather between the 183 and Runberg area. It was not on the main lanes. It was actually over on the frontage road, but you can see some folks heading actually southbound, maybe looking across the road to see what's going on there. If you do want to avoid this, we've got a couple ways around it. Take the 290 exit as you head north to undershoot that problem area, or just take the breaker lane exit if you want to overshoot it, because we are getting word actually that the frontage road there is closed between 183 and Runberg as well. You can see there it is right there. This is the Runberg exit being shut off by police, but notice in the main lanes there is no backup being observed. Now our own Alicia Inns is out at the scene live gathering all the details. Alicia, what's the latest? Hey, good morning, David. Yeah, I think drivers are going to be very appreciative of you giving them some alternate routes simply because we do understand that this frontage road is going to be closed off for at least another hour or two. And as you can see behind me, I'm going to step aside and show you still very active scene investigators out here working this and trying to figure out exactly what happened. But I can tell you, according to the sergeant working out here with APD, a, um, a, a pickup truck was traveling behind, northbound behind three 18 wheelers. It then crashed into the back of one of those 18 wheelers and ended up going underneath the semi truck. The driver of that pickup truck died, died out here on the scene. He was a Hispanic male in his 20s. The driver of the 18 wheeler at the back that it ran into, he was taken to the hospital with minor injuries. Again, this is something where the trucks are now being inspected. The medical examiner is out here, but officials out here do expect to get that all cleared up within the next hour. We actually did talk to the sergeant about 15 minutes ago. He told us that this crash should actually be cleared out within the next hour, maybe two hours maximum. But again, this frontage road in this area is closed off to drivers. The main lanes are not, so drivers are still flowing. Traffic is still flowing pretty easily right now in that direction. Again, just make sure you kind of stay clear of this area if you want to the next couple hours, but they should be cleared off within that time. We're going to stay out here and bring you the very latest as soon as we get it. Reporting live in North Austin, Alicia Inns, KXAN News.